enjoy all the culture. And yes, don't forget to watch Miss Universe this year in Thailand, December 16th. I'm going to be completely representing my country as a valor. And for now, I'm enjoying Philippines. Thank you so much. Thank you so much, Miss Marisela. So are you ready now? I'm ready and I, I came to the Philippines to be even more ready. Why Whoa. did you choose the Philippines to be your training? I, yes. I have a career uh, as a Latina in, in, the, in the United mm -hmm. States and I've learned a lot from Latinos mm -hmm. and I feel like for Miss Universe I needed something else. I needed that vision from this side of the world and learn the way you guys um, see pageants mm -hmm. and I feel that, that I'm going to learn a lot here. Um, you researched for a training, for yes, a training place, I, and I, you found the Philippines. I found the Philippines is like one of the, the most fans of Miss, uh, Miss Universe, mm -hmm. and I feel like this is going to be great. Mm -hmm. oh, we wish you the best of yeah. luck. Thank you. Wish you the best of Thank luck. You. You're so beautiful. And uh, I hope, uh, back in uh, El Salvador, what do you do? Are you a fashion model, an actress? Back in Salvador, yes. I, I'm recognized because I won a reality pageant show for Univision, which is a very famous Latino uh, network. Mm -hmm. And I won a reality pageant show, and since then I've been modeling, doing a lot of hosting, TV hosting, commercials, and, and now I'm representing El Salvador in Miss Universe. Wow, that's great. I know, like, you and other girls are very hopeful that you will win the crown, but who do you think is your, best, like, uh, number one contender, closest contender? Honestly, um, there's, uh, this year is, is hard. I feel like I've been watching Miss Universe um, since I, since I was a little girl, and 
I feel that this year is, is very competitive and that's why I'm here in the Philippines because I know I will learn a lot more and, and be in that level that the Miss Universe is looking and I feel that, you know, you have to watch out even for the small countries here. Mm -hmm. That's why I'm going to go to small countries. <laughs> yes. Just to let everybody know. Thank you. <laughs> yes, hopefully. I have yeah. a lot of faith in God and mm -hmm. um, He'll know what's the best for me and I'm just doing my, the best of that I can. Amen. I think that's also Amen. destiny. Yeah. Huh? Yes. yes. It's destiny. If God put me here in the Philippines, yeah. it's maybe for a return. <laughs> and if God puts you because makes you become this universe, it's, it's also destiny. because of him. Yes. Yeah. Okay, okay. Mate, we got we'll be back with her in a while. Yes. We have two very special guests, yeah. Play from Akin with the number guests, no? They're good singers, two of the country's most uh more prize possessions in the mm -hmm. industry. Mm -hmm. Ma bagu masila pa powerful. They have uh, the best voices, eh? Mm -hmm. Male voices. At Mel's and concert, that's my kapati to make the bihira and my kapati na napakagaling kumanta. Siyempre, pakilala natin, Luis and Nino, Grahera ba o Grahera? Grahera po. Grahera. Okay. Oh, hello. Good evening, Luis. Good evening po sa inyo. 